so I think you should remove these handrails. This one, the front one, and pull up the first two deck boards. One's a breadboard, and the second one is just covering up the first beam. And expose that beam right there, which it has an inch and a half or a two inch node to the front, but it's a decorative stair stepping thing going down to the surface of this one. But why they notched it was just stupid. They took most of the pole away when they notched it, and it didn't have to be. It could have stopped here and started back up. There's like nothing holding this, it's all just mush. So that double step thing is that, if you can see it. That detail right there. That's what the second board is right there. And there's the face and there's the spacer to get you out that far. Yeah. You would have just bolted together up here and notched out about two foot on center. The whole structure seems to be leaning. There's no joist hangers. It needs lagged in up here. If I can hold the camera still. Up in there, those need like some better lags, I would think. I don't know what they're going into as far as what's behind the wall. Then this side's the same. Here's the deck boards. <clears throat> that. And there's some out here in the middle. These definitely, but that one that's low, but these here, there's no sense in uprooting them if they look like that on the surface, just paint them. These of course have to go. This is interesting though. Hmm. He used that for a, a gib post or whatever to hook a chain and a come along to. There's not enough integrity left in it to use it like that. I don't know if it'll hold 250 pounds plus it's got a roof load. So the roof needs suspended <laughs> off of the beam. The beam needs suspended off of the concrete. Yuck. This looks like separation to me. It's pulled, it's moved that much probably in its life. <laughs> 